the Zartastic YouTube channel um, where we are doing things strange and different here and we are going to, well you get to watch me every single week if you subscribe. You get to watch me take two words, uh, just any two words and then I'm going to turn it into something visual right in front of you. Yes! I'm going to just make it up right on the spot. Yeah. You get to watch me draw uh, and you can join me if you want to. I highly encourage it so you can add your own, our own artist flavor and also practice being a creative thinker. Now our two words today that I'm going to take and make up as a design in front of you on this spot are knowledgeable koala. A knowledgeable koala. Where are we going? In this episode, we're going to be drawing this knowledgeable koala. So grab something to draw with and something to color with and let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, we're going to draw our knowledgeable koala. Okay. Oh, my hands have paint on them. Sorry. All right. Knowledgeable koala. Whoa. So much paint. We're going to begin with knowledgeable, knowledgeable koala's head with two curving lines. Knowledgeable koala. So two words. We're going to make it into something. A nice challenge for ourselves to be creative. Knowledgeable koala. And it's knowledgeable. So it has a big head. So let's actually extend these lines further down. That. And then we'll add the fluffies on the top of the head. I know it's super weird looking, right? That's why we that's why you're over on this channel. Because we do things differently over here. And we're doing a knowledgeable koala. Alright, uh, fluffy on the head. We'll add two curving lines on either side here. So the face is actually gonna be lower than expected because it's a nice big brain cavity. It's so knowledgeable, you know. And then we'll add some ear some zigzag lines back in for the cute little koala ears. Okay, we're gonna draw a nose with a nice big oval. And then we're gonna draw a curving line down one side that will stay white. And then we'll color in the rest with a darker color. Draw a line at the center of each ear for the fold of the ear. And then we're going to draw a fluffy line down on either side and connect at the bottom. On either side of the nose, we're going to draw a circle. In each circle, we're going to draw one big circle and two small circles. And then you can go ahead and color in the dark of those eyes, leaving just the circles white. fluffy little hatching lines up the ears and also down the sides of the knowledgeable koala's head. So knowledgeable, right? There we go. And add some fluffies on the face. And then we'll have just some fluffies go down on either side. And then maybe there's a little paw coming up here. I'm just, just waving. Guys, 
I'm knowledgeable koala. Ask me any sort of question because I can answer all of them because I am knowledgeable. That's what knowledgeable koalas do. All right. And once you're done, you can go ahead and color in your knowledgeable koala using your choice of art making mediums and colors. And don't worry, it's knowledgeable. So if you are stuck, just ask it a question and it can answer anything because look how big its brain is. Yep. It's knowledgeable. you to draw this and share your drawing if you want to stitch this video and show your knowledgeable koala koala that'd be so cool that'd be great great way to build a community Once you're done, your knowledgeable koala is done.